And like many industries, the theater industry is suffering during this pandemic. Everything from Broadway shows to high school musicals have been canceled. Yeah, but Jim, one Delaware Valley group has come up with an idea to help lessen the blow. Eyewitness News reporter Jen Carabello is joining us live along the Avenue of the Arts with a look. I just love this story, Jen. Good morning. Jim and Janelle, good morning. That's right. This pandemic has been painful for everyone. The theaters along the Avenue of the Arts here in Philadelphia have been closed for some time now with no reopening in sight. So that has a lot of local thespians wondering if online platforms can help save their art. And one group is prepared to test its idea this weekend. It's the last wish. The witch. There are giants in the sky. Jack. So you pry up your shoes. And Cinderella, all on one virtual stage. Any theater buff knows these actors are rehearsing the hit musical Into the Woods. It's these woods. This is my, my stage. This is exactly where I recorded all of my videos uh, right here. Yeah, it's a little bit crazy. Crazy because on Saturday, this new theater group will showcase a month of hard work. Streaming their performance online, the actors never once having shared the same physical space. And we're so lucky that we have so many wonderful friends who were so willing to just sort of jump into to a full new experience like this. Abby Sani and Aaron Duffy are the co-creators of Quarantine Theatricals. Stuck at home during the pandemic, the pair needed an outlet. After all, they've loved theater since childhood. Ever since then, I've been directing and stage managing in South Jersey. And my wheelhouse has always been performing a little bit more, so kind of when we put our two minds together, we have a really interesting perspective. You're two sure. sides of the same coin here, I think. <laughs> Exactly. Quarantine theatricals includes more than a dozen Delaware Valley actors ranging from just 15 to 20 years old. They rehearsed using Jitsi Meet, an app similar to Zoom. Once perfected, the actors then individually recorded their roles, including reactions to other characters. So none of us really came in knowing how that would look, um, but we're we're taking it day by day and step by step. <laughs> The final step was editing the recorded scenes together for a seamless performance. Still, these actors can't wait to get back on stage together. It's that energy that you miss from being with everyone in a room. In the meantime, what they've created while stuck in quarantine delivers the same message as their musical, Into the Woods. No matter what you're going through, you're always going to have people on your side. And we thought that in these troubled times that a message like no one is alone was the perfect thing to share with everyone. Quarantine Theatricals debuts its production of Into the Woods tomorrow night at 7 p.m. on Facebook and YouTube. It is streaming live. And then once it streams, it's right back to work for this group. The next production, just a little something called Grease, a fan favorite. We're reporting live along the Avenue of the Arts this morning. Jan Carabello, CBS3 Eyewitness News, back into you. And Jan, they sound amazing. The fact that they recorded those parts individually and then combined it together, really impressive there. Technical skills to boot. Yeah, yeah. Yes. All right, looking forward to seeing more of that. Thanks, Jan.